the Pigpen cipher is a geometric simple substitution cipher, which exchanges letters for symbols which are fragments of a grid. The example key shows one way the letters can be assigned to the grid. Security The use of symbols instead of letters is no impediment to cryptanalysis, and this system is identical to that of other simple monoalphabetic substitution schemes. Due to the simplicity of the cipher, it is often included in children's books on ciphers and secret writing. History The exact origin of the cipher is uncertain, but records of this system have been found which go back to at least the 18th century. Variations of this cipher were used by both the Rosicrucian Brotherhood and the Freemasons, though the latter used it so often that the system is frequently called the Freemason cipher. They began using it in the early 18th century to keep their records of history and rites private and for correspondence between lodge leaders. Tombstones of Freemasons can also be found which use the system as part of the engravings. One of the earliest stones in Trinity Church Cemetery in New York City, which opened in 1697, contains a cipher of this type which deciphers to remember death. George Washington's army had documentation about the system, with a much more randomized form of the alphabet. And during the American Civil War, the system was used by Union prisoners in Confederate prisons. Variants The core elements of this system are the grid and dots. Some systems use the X's, but even these can be rearranged. One commonly used method orders the symbols as shown in the above image, grid, grid, X, X. Another commonly used system orders the symbols as grid, X, grid, X. Another is grid, grid, grid with each cell having a letter of the alphabet, and the last one having an ampersand character. Letters from the first grid have no dot, letters from the second each have one dot, and letters from the third each have two dots. Another variation of this last one is called the Newark cipher, which instead of dots uses one to three short lines which may be projecting in any length or orientation. This gives the illusion of a larger number of different characters than actually exist. Another system used by the Rosicrucians, used a single grid of nine cells, and one to three dots in each cell or pen. So ABC would be in the top left pen, followed by DEF and GHI on the first line, then groups of JKLMNOPQR on the second, and STUVWXYZ on the third. When in Kifford, the location of the dot in each symbol, would indicate which letter in that pen was represented. More difficult systems use a non-standard form of the alphabet, such as writing it backwards in the grid, up and down in the columns, or a completely randomized set of letters. The Templar cipher is a method claimed to have been used by the Knights Templar. It uses a variant of a Maltese cross. Example, using the pig pen cipher key above, the message X marks the spot is rendered in cipher text as in popular culture. The pig pen cipher has been used in several works of popular culture including Dan Brown's 2009 novel The Lost Symbol, both in the book itself, and also to provide a puzzle in the artwork of the U.S. version of the book Jacket. The Trap, a 2009 nominee for Lancashire Children's Book of the Year, uses a variation of the pig pen cipher. Author Clifford B. Hicks included the cipher in his 1963 children's book Alvin's Secret Code with title character Alvin Fennald explaining its use by Civil War soldiers. Used in the book The Voyage of the Mimi. The cover of the Outfield's 1989 album, Voices of Babylon, is written in a pig pen cipher similar to the version shown to the right, as of the song titles and the album's liner notes. The 39 Clues series of popular children's books uses pig pen cipher in many of its puzzles in books and its gaming website. In the game Assassin's Creed 2, a variant of pig pen is used to provide additional information about the story, in addition to Morse code and binary code. In the novel Time Riders, the Doomsday Code, it is used to encrypt a message to the present day from the past. The BBC series Sherlock has created a website to correlate with the events in the series, The Science of Deduction. Under the Hidden Messages tab, Sherlock lists three coded messages he received from a stalker, and the third is in pig pen cipher. The message says Sherlock I have found you. In Club Penguin, a children's MMO, a modified pig pen cipher is used in the secret agent aspect of the game. 
In the beginning of Linkin Park's In the End music video, the doorway that Chester emerges from is inscribed in pig pen symbols, in the Call of Duty, Black Ops 2 Zombies map buried, the pig pen cipher forms part of the quest for players to complete an Easter egg achievement. Players are required to decipher a code in order to proceed on with the quest. The code uses a cipher based on the letters of the alphabet being grouped into three letters with a corresponding letter being annotated by a line inside the cipher. Notes. References. Barker, Wayne G., ed. The History of Codes and Ciphers in the United States Prior to World War IG and Park Press. ISBN 0-89412-026-3. Gardner, Martin. Codes, Ciphers and Secret Writing. ISBN 0-486-24761-9. Khan, David. The Code Breakers. The Story of Secret Writing. Macmillan. Khan, David. The Code Breakers. The Story of Secret Writing. Scribner. ISBN 0-684-83130-9. Newton, David E. Freemason Cipher. Encyclopedia of Cryptology. ISBN 0-87436-772-7. Pratt, Fletcher. Secret and Urgent, The Story of Codes and Ciphers. Aegean Park Press. ISBN 0-89412-261-4. Sherman, David. Weintraub, Joseph. A Glossary of Cryptography. Crypto Press. Pages 44. Rickson, Frederick B. Codes, Ciphers, and Other Cryptic and Clandestine Communication. Black Dog and Leventhal Publishers, Inc. ISBN 1-57912-040-7. External links. The Alliance script is a similar grid-based cipher, used as art. Online Pigpen Cipher Tool for Enciphering Small Messages. Cipher code true type font, Cryptia converts text in pig pen cipher and more.